Hello Libra, welcome to your August 1st through August 15th, 2017 general reading. If you would like to book a private reading with myself, all that information is in the description below. So let's go ahead and get started. They are not wanting to come together. Okay. Remember that these are general. They're not going to resonate with everybody. We have the Four of Wands. Okay, so some type of building a foundation, building a new home, building something from the ground up. Of course not for some of you it's not literally you're gonna go build a home but it's a relationship that just started okay it's just something new something very new okay top row past present future potential future of course all right let's see so, okay, so you have two major arcana cards. All right, hopefully you guys could see. In the past, we have the Ace of Pentacles, some type of loss of money. Okay, and then we have the Seven of Wands. The Seven of Wands either actually no when it's in reverse it means overwhelmed okay so financially for some of you i don't know if you guys are having a hard time finding a job um just financial issues okay then we have the two of swords in reverse some confusion okay for some of you, you had jobs, okay, but it wasn't what you expected. So some of you guys just got a job, then lost a job. You know what I mean? Like that constant um, leaving and getting another job, leaving and getting another job. And that's for some of you how it's been going. For some of you, actually, um, you guys had gotten some offers in different states or people are telling you to go to a different location and I mean it's, you're not really too a hundred percent sure if you should or you shouldn't okay all right and then we have the knight of cups okay so yeah the knight of cups I was thinking the Page of Cups, but the Knight of Cups is some type of offering. Um, I don't know if somebody is trying to offer you new love or just offering you something emotionally. Maybe on a date. I don't know. It just It's a really good card. Okay? So definitely somebody might be coming your way offering you some and it is cup so it is water sign so cancer scorpio or pisces could be the one coming towards you okay and then we have the five of cups in reverse so accepting something and moving on okay now a lot of you and i feel like Going back to the past, okay, it was definitely something you were confused about, whether you should or you shouldn't let go. Okay, overwhelmment, again, 
being very confused. And I feel like at the same time, you're trying to kind of adapt of what's going on. But at the same time, it's like somebody was offering you something. So, in other words, you're still trying to get over somebody or something, but also somebody is trying to offer you something. Okay? So, you definitely accepted what has happened, but now it's all about moving on, moving forward. Then we have the Hierophant. Hierophant, however you want to pronounce it. So, traditions, this has to do with, you know, sticking to your traditions, sticking to a community. Um, oh my goodness. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, Yes, sticking to your tradition, sticking, I feel like a lot of you guys are going to finally hang around with people who are positive, okay, but we'll get some more clarification on this card. Then, for the potential future, we have the lover's card, we have the queen of cups, and then we have the page of cups. Okay, you could be involving, you could meet a Gemini. Um, also, it's just, you know, coming together, loving something. This doesn't necessarily have to do love in a relationship. This could also mean love for something that you love, you know, whether it's your home, your job, your, your dream. Okay, and then with the Queen of Cups. You know, this queen here is focused. So, for some of you, it's like you're finally following your dreams. Okay, but... And some of you are starting this relationship, right? But with this card here emotionally immature somebody that you're involved with is immature and right after the lover's card the queen and this page so you may have love for this person you may want to give this person a chance but I feel like they're very immature For some reason in the month of August, so far the readings that I've done, it's like it wants to lean more towards love. I don't know if a lot of people are going through breakups, heartbreaks, heartaches, involving friendships. Okay. Okay, so for those who have lost money in the past, oh, I can't get definitely you guys are okay. You guys are definitely okay, you know, feeling satisfied, getting, getting out of that financial loss, okay? So just because this card is out there doesn't mean that's it for you guys. Like, no, these two cards here, it's like, yeah, I'm okay. You know, I might have lost a few dollars here and there, but I'm I'm fine. Okay. Feeling stuck. Overwhelmed, feeling stuck. Of course, you can't make up your mind. The strength card. 
Okay. We all know that Libras are very strong people. The Knight of Cups. Okay, two. Two cards. We have the Knight of Wands. Then we have the Two of Cups. The person that is offering you something is number one, attracted to you. I feel like they're like they saw you and they're like, oh, I, I want that person. Okay? But then we have this Two of Cups here. I feel like there's some things that might click, but there's a lot of things that you guys just don't click. the six of wands and the devil card regaining your power victory but remember with the six of wands yeah okay you could finally be like on, let's take a look at these cards accepting what has happened and moving on from it regaining your power Finally, whether it's you telling yourself, celebrating, or your friend is like, finally, you, you saw the light, finally. But just know that this is just the beginning of that celebration. I mean, you still have to go through more good and bad in life. card we have the six of cups we have the ten of cups okay all right so some of you guys have had history with this person some of you guys were married with this person okay it's it's a lot more you've known this person from the past but I mean, there's this Ten of Cups here. Broken home, broken marriage. There's no happiness. But I feel like you still have that hope with this Temperance card. It's like no matter what, I still want, I still have hope. I still want to give this person maybe another week to change or another month. Like, I'm just going to go with that gut feeling. Sticking to your traditions. For some of those who believe to not just get up and go just like that. too much I'm just gonna leave the moon card out here the moon card in reverse for the lovers card there's times where things were beautiful there's times that it still can be beautiful but there's also times where it's it's sucking you alive you know and yeah if there was secrets if Everything has come up to the light. Everything is coming out into the light. Okay? Two of Pentacles. You know you are very strong. Very strong. But you still keep going in the same cycle page. 
we have the Eight of Wands, and we have the Knight of Swords in reverse. Okay, I feel like when things come up to the surface, it's like words and everything starts coming out really quick, and it's like, okay, I'm going to leave, okay, you're going to leave, like, shit happens really, really quick, from one minute to the next, okay? Oh man, I feel like this person that you're involved with is is immature, very immature. But you still, I feel like again that you still have hope. You still have hope. It is a the world card in reverse. The world card in reverse means bad luck and honestly I feel like it's just gonna continue to happen if you keep dealing with the same the same thing over and over I feel like you're not gonna get anywhere I feel like you guys might have issues and then that day talk about it and then a week later it happens again and you guys are back to square one. Getting to know each other as you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. And then wedding. The situation involves marriage. Okay. So for some of you, this is going to be a very big help. For some of you, it's like, no, way out of, out of here. Not just because it's a wedding car. That doesn't mean if you met somebody, you're going to get married in the next three months now this could just mean just a, a commitment instead of just dating here and there dating a lot of people it might be like hey you want to be my girlfriend boyfriend whatever so getting to know each other and I feel like especially with your guys's reading you really I feel like you really 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 need to sit down and talk but I mean let it all out. And I know it's going to be very hard. Okay? Maybe you have. Maybe the other person just hasn't. And that's the problem. So, from there, it's like, what, what are the next steps that you're going to take? Counseling, a breakup. I mean, something needs to happen. Because as to what I'm seeing, it's like a cycle. A cycle. Okay? So, get to really know each other. Again, that's only for some, some people. For some people, it's like, oh no, I already left that person. I don't got time for, for that person. I'm already moving on. Okay, that's cool. That's very good. That was just a message for some people, okay? Life Review, Archangel Hermin. Take inventory of your life and resolve to change or heal anything that is unbalanced. Okay? 
All right, Libras. I will see you guys very, very soon. Take care. And like I always say, I wish nothing but the best for every single one of you.